Thank you, Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Every one of you that is watching tonight, wherever you are watching, God bless you. My name is Apostle Sean, your beloved prophet, your beloved mentor, your beloved spiritual father, your beloved business trainer, business mentor, financial advisor. This is Dr. Sean, and we are live on a prophetic gateway tv coming to you live glory to god if you are watching in let us know that you are there we are successfully connected to all our channels glory to god you can watch us in a total of 18 different channels you can watch us on youtube you can watch us on twitter you can watch us on instagram twitter x sorry you can watch out in all the facebook uh pages and channels right now we're broadcasting real time glory to god hallelujah god bless you god bless you god bless you watch us on facebook instagram youtube and twitter x and of course very soon we will be connected to tiktok are you following me on tiktok if you're not join the tiktok the moment we reach a thousand followers then tiktok will be added to one of the channels glory to god do you know dr sean is on tiktok yeah what is your name on TikTok? It's the same name, not any different name. The same name, Dr. Sean Anike. If you go to YouTube, Dr. Sean Anike, go to Twitter X, Dr. Sean Anike, go to Instagram, Dr. Sean Anike, come to Facebook. You go to official Facebook profile, you will find me there as Dr. Sean Anike. And also, wait, my profile page, I'm live on my white page, live on the ministry page, live on the two group page, live on the other ministry page. So we are literally live every place. But tonight, glory to God. The power of God is going to move mightily. We are in the era of the kingdom. We are in the month of royalty and rulership. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And in this month, glory to God, God is doing something in this year of greatness and capacity. We are in the fourth month, the month of royalty and rulership. Are you royal in the kingdom? Then you must roll, not just being royal. You can't be royal without ruling. If you're royal without ruling in different places, then something is wrong with your royalty. You cannot be royal without ruling. Glory to God. God bless you, uh, Prophet Felicia Daniel, all the way from uh, Houston, Texas. Glory to God. And God bless you, Nicole Wimbley. It's good to see you. Glory to God. Wherever you are watching, let me know that you are there. Don't be quiet. Glory to God. We're going to get something done tonight. Why? Because I love when God speaks to his word. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Glory to God. I feel so much anointing in here. Somebody is going to be touched tonight. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. I'm going to make some few announcements. If you are watching for the first time, let us know that this is your first time watching. And if you can hear me loudly and clearly, please do let us know that you can also hear me and uh, clearly. I apologize for being late. Glory to a stream. I think 20 minutes late. Glory to God. That is a lot of late. But um, we're still making sure that everything is connected because if all the channel is not connected, then I will not, I will not go live. If you know me, I have the spirit of excellence and it requires people like us. We go on the extreme to be able to make things uh, become perfect for the kingdom. Those of you that know me, you see the spirit of excellence is something I've been like that. God bless you. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Whatever you are watching, let me know that you can see me loudly and you can also hear me loudly wherever you you are glory to god you can hear me loud and clear i'm going to make some few announcement uh tonight and this announcement is important i want you to uh focus god bless you maya alexander is good to see you in the house uh tonight it's good to see you if you come in quickly quickly say hello glory to god the power of god is going to move tonight why because we are in the fourth month the month of light the month of god say rulership god say royalty are you a royal the bible says we are royal priesthood and a peculiar that means different people glory to god god bless you leticia equizeda i hope i pronounced you know the last name right Le, um 
uh, Leticia Quezera. God bless you for watching. Watching from my wife. God bless you, Minister uh, uh, Latoya Alexander. It's good to see you uh, tonight. If you come in quickly, quickly say hello. Don't be quiet. Glory to God. I am seated, not standing on a pulpit. Seated in my own home. And Prophet is Beverly, my beautiful wife, is my tech tonight. Glory to God. So she is sitting behind the camera, uh, being my tech tonight because of a lot of advancement that we're moving. But I'm going to make some few announcements. Glory to God. This coming weekend, this coming Saturday, prophetess herself, glory to God, is going to be speaking. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Shekinah Breakthrough Conference. Glory to God. Hallelujah. You do not want to miss it. It's happening this weekend. God bless you. God bless you. Tricia Butcher, God bless you. Lucy Kane, God bless you. If you're coming in quickly, Lisa Marie, God bless you. Glory to God. If you're coming in quickly, quickly, let me know that you are there. If you come in quickly, say hello. Don't be quiet. You know, some people, they enter and they're quiet. And I've always wondered, if you're already in the room, they might as well just say hello. Sometimes they're quiet. And one of the things, though, is that sometimes the Holy Spirit tells me that someone have entered. I don't have access to all the 18 channels. I have access to four uh, channels. But John Prophetess Beverly, the host, is none other than Dr. Pedro Gita. Prophetess Dr. Pedro Gita will be hosting Shakira Glory Breakthrough. And Prophetess Beverly Anika will be ministering their glory to God. This coming Saturday, you do not want to miss it. Glory to God. The power of God is going to be moving mightily there. Glory to God. Prophetess is one of the speakers. There are three speakers there. Glory to God. Plus the host. Glory to God. Please uh, contact Prophetess. God bless you. Prophetess Victoria Vakta is good to see you in the house tonight. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. If you come in quickly, quickly, don't be quiet. Come in. Say hello. Glory to God. This is a prophetic gateway TV. It's a channel that belongs to God. It's a TV. Glory to God. Where only God and the Holy Ghost and the angels are functioning. So you might as well just join it and tap into the kingdom. Glory to God. I'm hearing the name Barbara. Barbara. I know a lot of Barbaras. Glory to God. But somebody Barbara. Glory to God. This is not about breakthrough. God is bringing increase and elevation into your life. Whoever that goes with Barbara. Right now, as I'm talking to you, there are over 400 people watching or all total of 18 different channels. But there is one Barbara in the broadcast tonight and this Baba God is giving you glory to God a supernatural increase and elevation is a turnaround God is doing a complete divine turnaround to lift you up and bring an a unique increase says the Holy Spirit God says fear not I am with you says the Holy Ghost glory to God so join prophetess Beverly these coming weekend glory to God for Shekinah Breakthrough Conference, glory to God, hosted by Dr. Pedro Gita and Prophetess will be ministering this Saturday. Contact Prophetess and then you will know the time and location. Glory to God, hallelujah. And then the next announcement, glory to God, we are literally three and a half weeks away from the Roach School of the Prophet, glory to God, 20. 24. Roa School of the Prophet 2024. We graduate student every year and it's coming the month of May. Listen very carefully so that you can get the date right. Have you registered yet? If not, then hurry to register. Hurry, hurry, hurry to register. Glory to God. Listen to this. Oh my goodness. I don't have enough time to really explain it, but all the information there on Facebook, if you go to my Facebook, it's my Facebook. Account. You can also go on my website, Glory to God. You can register on www.seananike.com. There are three seasons, five classes. Each season, that is a total of 15 classes with over 45 hours filled with prophetic Malachi Sungri Elita. I just say something concerning a Barbara earlier. Glory to God. And I don't know whether you were able to catch it, but I just see another Barbara that just entered. But God was mentioning a Barbara earlier. Glory to God. Speaking speaking prophetically. I just see Barbara Riddick that just entered. Glory to God. There is a word. And of course, if that comes up again, I'll release it. But I just said it earlier. I can't rewind it back, but it has to come back again if you miss it. But at that time, there was one Barbara now we have wow now we have three barbaras connected i can only see one glory to god hallelujah thank you holy spirit now listen listen our prophetic school season one is may 9 through 11 season two is may 16 through 18 and season three is may 
uh, 23rd through 25th. It is online. Glory to God. It is not the one you log in and then watch and go out. No, no, no. It's life. It's a life. It, there's a live teaching, live discussion, live different things, live questionnaires, live intense discussion that define the prophetic mysteries, prophetic dimension, prophetic protocols, prophetic functions, and prophetic realms and status. Season 1, I have five major curriculum divided that is made up of 12 chapters. Every season have unique, intense subject and chapters. For example, season 1, I wrote season 1 curriculum and the courses on Facebook. Glory to God. If you can go to my Facebook page and then the Facebook cover and also my ministry page, Facebook cover, you tap, you see five major curriculum on season one and these five major curriculum have 12 subjects critical which takes 12 to 14 hours to finish discussing glory to god so season one let me say it again is glory season one hallelujah is uh season one is may 9 through may 11 season two is may 16 through may 18 season three is may 23rd through may glory to god may 23rd through may 25th so if you are watching in glory to god you can immediately uh make sure that uh, you register glory to god make sure that you register hallelujah thank you holy spirit make sure that you register glory to god hallelujah are you still here come on say, i'm still here Glory to God. So that is for the prophetic uh, school. And then the next announcement, I'm rushing so fast so that we can get into why we are here tonight. The company of prophet, glory to God, is uh, coming up, hallelujah, in the first Tuesday of the month of May. The company of prophet is a gathering of those that are in the prophetic glory to God. The next one is May 7. Glory to God, May 7. You don't want to miss it. Hallelujah. But are you registering to the prophetic school? Then make sure that you hurry to register. Reserve your spot because I will close in the registration May 8. The last day to register is May 8. So you have between now and May 8 to register for the prophetic school. Glory to God. So make sure that you register. Glory to God for the upcoming Roar School of the Prophet. Glory to God. You don't want to miss it. So, but the company of prophet comes in next month, May the 7th. That is the announcement that I have for now. Glory to God. Are you ready to receive from the Holy Ghost? Hallelujah. I am excited this night. Karaluku Sangra Ali Dabaya. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Who is still here? Come on, say, I'm still here. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. I love this month. Why? Because it is the month. Thank you, Holy Spirit. I'm hearing Williams. Williams is a last name. I know a lot of Williams. But there is a specific William here that God is giving victory. God is giving you instant and like a rush victory. That means it's going to happen fast. Glory to God. You go by Williams as a last name. Receive instant victory. A rush victory. That means something has been happening and it's creating crisis upon crisis. But God is giving you instant victory. A rush victory. You know that sometimes God can rush a victory. Glory to God. Father, open the portals. And reach out to as many that are connected to this web, to this uh, broadcast tonight. Glory to God. Hallelujah. God bless you, Michelle Cole. It's good to see you in the house tonight. If you're coming in, quickly, quickly say hello. Those of you that are watching on YouTube, don't be quiet. Glory to God. I can see you watching on YouTube. Don't be quiet. Say hello. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Now, this is the month of royalty and rulership. And one of the things about God is God bringing specific word. And tonight, word is very intense. God bless you, prophetess, uh, 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 prophetess uh, Tammy Cassandra uh, Cross. It's good to see you. God bless you, Tasha Clemens. It's good to see you. If you come in quickly, quickly say hello. Glory to God. So now, the word of the Lord tonight is very, very unique and very, very intense. Now listen, you get into that place where the things that you're doing and where you are and what you're so sure 
that it is of God. You're doing it, but you don't seem to be getting uh, uh, to be getting through, to be getting results, to be making it. You feel pressed. You are afraid or worried whether you are safe, whether it will be provided, whether the resources will be there. Hey, Katabaya, I used to hear. Am I talking to someone? You've been to that place. You are doing what you know. That's what God has given you instruction. That's what God has called you to do. That's what God has ordained you to do. And you are so sure that that's what you're doing. But then again, you look at the result, the outcome. You look at the resources and there is a big gulf between you and what you are doing. Between you and the result. And so sometimes the concern about whether the resources will ever come through. Whether it is safe. Whether it will be protected. Whether God will take care of it. And the word of the Lord come unto me this morning saying, tell my people that I ordain it. I will provide for it and I will protect it. Thank you, Holy Spirit. He said, tell them, I ordained it. It will be provided for and it will be protected. That business, God will say, is God ordained. It will be God provided and it will be God protected. That marriage, it is God ordained, God provided and God protected. That, 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 that career, that thing, that, that ministry, it is God ordained. It will be God provided and it will be God protected. Stop fearing whether you're going to lose it, whether you're going to lose your business, whether you're going to lose your career, whether you're going to lose your job, whether you're going to lose your house, whether you're going to lose different stuff. God said that it is ordained and it will be provided and it will be protected. You know what I called it after studying this in my morning devotion? I said, my goodness, I love it. So I call it God ordained, God provided, God protected. Glory to God. <laughs> I don't know who I'm talking to. You've been in that place where you're wondering, are you doing something wrong? Did you miss it? No, you didn't miss it. <laughs> you did. The enemy is trying to frustrate you, but that frustration come to an end tonight because it is ordained. You don't have to worry. Stop worrying whether it will be provided for, whether the resources will bear. I'm here to announce to you, thus says the Lord, because it is God ordained. God said it will be God provided and it will be God protected. Glory to God. Your business is God. God provided, God provided, God protected. Your marriage, stop being afraid. The enemy can fight and fight. And when the enemy finishes fighting, you are still standing. God said, fear not because I ordain it. I will provide for it and I will protect, protect it. Glory to God. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Are you still here? Some of the time I'm still here. I don't know who I'm talking to tonight. Are you still here? Relakata brakurike sun tebruya. Thank you, Holy Spirit. When God ordained it, He will provide for it. He will protect it. Stop fearing whether you will lose it. You know, I like you same very a low tap here. Don't be like Job. God gave him a blessing. God bless you, Prophet Darin. Have it's good to see you tonight. Glory to God away from North Carolina. It's good to see you tonight. Stop fearing. Job was blessed massively. But he was afraid if God will be able to protect it. Hey, Katabaya. Refuse to be fearing of losing something God has given you. Refuse to be thinking that the resource will not come. That the Lord will not provide for it. That you're not going to have what you need. Is it God ordained? Then God say, relax. Because it shall be God provided and God protected. Because the fear will throw you off course. It will get you doing something wrong. God will say, stay on your belief. Stay on your faith. Because I got you provided for and I got you protected. Job was afraid of losing what God blessed him. Listen, God is the blesser. And God is also is the protector. God can bless you with something he cannot protect. God cannot bless you with something he cannot provide for. That makes him a man. But God is 
not a man. I prophesy into your household tonight, into your ministry, into your destiny. God ordained it, and that same God will protect it, and that same God will provide for it, and that same God will direct you, that same God will connect you. Sometimes you feel alone, but it is God ordained, and God will make the connection, divine connection. God is going to connect you to the right people. Sometimes you're connected to the wrong people, and you're losing time, but God said, the time of losing time is over, because from this moment on, remember, God ordained it, and that same God will make the connections. I used to hear, come as I receive it. Glory to God. Glory to God. God bless you, Daryl Johnson. It's good to see you. Glory to God, whatever you're watching. If you're watching, just, just, just make sure that like tukri izun tibriya. Vankre elida bakata bruke izun tibriya. Hey! God ordained, God provided, and God protected. Job was afraid of losing what God blessed him. Now, who blessed him? God. The Bible said, The blessing of the Lord, he make it rich and added no sorrow. And added no sorrow. Stop being afraid whether God will see it through. Listen, this is the month of royalty. If God made you royal, do you think God will be incapable of providing for you? Do you think God will be incapable of doing what he say he will do? Do you think God will be incapable of protecting you and your family? Do you think God is incapable of making sure that what he bless you with will be provided for, will be protected? Sometimes you are afraid of losing something something have you ever been in that place where you're afraid of losing something and after being afraid of losing it you realize you didn't actually lose it glory to god stop being afraid if your children are going to go out of control who gave you the children god bless you with the children glory to god stop being afraid if you're going to lose your business if you're going to lose your call if you're going to lose your destiny if you're going to lose your job if you're going to lose your car if you're going to lose your job if you're going to lose your house stop being afraid god said and i prophesy to you tonight that because it is god then god say i will pro Provide for it. It will be provided for and it will be protected. Katabaya. Glory to Sotabaya. Come and say, I receive it. Glory to God. God ordained it. Is it God ordained? If that's a yes, then he will protect it. Hey, Katabaya. God bless you, Pastor. Pastor Sandra is good to see you tonight. All the way from Oklahoma. The question is. Is it God ordained? God bless you, Prophet Richard uh, Palacios. Good to see you in the house. Is it God ordained? That's a question. Is it God ordained? Then God said, I will protect it and I will provide for it. Job was afraid. Glory to God. A new testimony coming on out of the prophetic gateway. Yes, your dad gave you 2000 and it was going to be uh, three to four weeks, I said, but he came two weeks early. Glory to God. That's a testimony just, just coming through prophetic gateway. Glory to God. Somebody, because God was speaking a car a few weeks ago and then that particular money for car. Some of you that are needing money for something, get ready because God is going to surprise you with that money. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Is it God ordained? Is it God? Then look at look at Joshua. He said, I will be with you whithersoever thou goest. God is saying, I will be with you. That means I will protect you. He said, there shall not be any man able to stand before you. In other words, able to stop you on this earth. In other words, God is giving him a permanent security. Whithersoever thou goest, I will be with you. He said, there shall not be any man to be able to stop you. King James says, stand before you. That means get in your way. Sometimes in life you see people who get in your way. They think they will be able to stop it. Glory to God. Uh, it, like they tried to stop Joseph. All they ended up doing is that they delayed time. But at the end of the day, that which God have already predestined ever come to pass as long as you don't lose your call make sure you don't lose yourself make sure you don't allow things you shouldn't allow make sure you don't go on the offense make sure you don't allow you don't allow the world to offend you so much that you go and hide in a cave no come out of the cave because god is saying if i ordain it i will provide for it and i will protect it he told Joshua, 
He said, there shall not be any man stand before you. In other words, no one will be able to get you in your way enough to stop you. I don't know who I'm talking to. God bless you, Minister George. It's good to see you tonight. He said, no one will be able to stop you all the days of your life. He said, I will be with you whithersoever thou goest. He told Isaiah, when you pass through the fire, you will not be born. When you pass through the water, you will not run your Why? Because I have ordained it. And because I'm ordained, if they throw you in the water, you will not drown. If they throw you in the fire, you will not burn. Why? Because it is God ordained and is God provided and is God protected. Glory to God. Come and say, I am protected. God say you are not unprotected. You are protected. Why? Why is the protection? Because God will protect his investment. I'll prophesy to you. Can I call it tonight? God say, you are my investment. Your business is my investment. Your call is my investment. Your, your, your ministry is my investment. Glory. God said, your call is my investment. Your ministry is my investment. The book you're writing is my investment. And I, God, will protect my investment. Glory to God. You are God investment and God will protect and provide. God is incapable of not protecting what he ordained. He will withdraw for what he is not in. But whatever God ordained, that same God will protect it. In other words, God will make provision for what he ordained. Because if God ordained it and unable to make the provision, that makes God look bad. That makes God a man and God is not a man. I used to hear. He said, God is not a man. He said, we are in that day. Royalty. I, I can go all over the scriptures and travel in and out. Paul said, I know whom I believe and I'm persuaded. Hey, he told the Philistines, and that's he which has begun a good work. In other words, God, do not abandon a project. You are God, divine project. I have a series called a divine project. I'll be preaching about it very soon. I don't know when. You are God, a project. And mankind can start a project and stop it along the way. But God can never start a project without finishing in it, without finishing it. Glory to God. I prophesy to you tonight, God is going to demonstrate himself that you are ordained, that your business is ordained, your, your marriage is ordained, and your life is ordained, your call is ordained, your destiny is ordained, your ministry is ordained, the book you're writing is ordained, your entrepreneur is ordained, your investment is ordained. I prophesy tonight, God say you are protected. Sometimes you feel incapable of seeing things in your finances. But God said, if it is God ordained, it will be God prevent, provided. It will be God protected. Stop being unprotected. Stop feeling unprotected. Stop being afraid. Stop worrying if you're going to be okay. The moment you start worrying, you're going to start doubting. And when you start doubting, you're going to develop fear. And when you develop fear, that's when you become unprotected. Why? Fear will make you unprotected. Fear will remove the shield. Even the devil testified that Job was protected. There was an evidence that there was a hedge made around Job. In other words, God blessed him and God protected him. Even the devil testified that you made a hedge around him. But guess what? Job was afraid of losing what God gave him. I don't know who I'm talking to, but I prophesy tonight. Every spirit of fear that is lingering around you, I call that spirit of fear to disappear from today. That spirit of fear, the spirit of fear that is gripping you. Anxiety. You know what fear does? It lingers there and lingers enough until it becomes anxiety. And the moment it tries to be anxiety, you start being afraid. You start being afraid. Like you begin to fear everything. You begin to even like like sometimes maybe something has gone wrong in the past and the enemy grip you with fear and the enemy just remove these level you wouldn't even want to trust a soul in fact you have no friend you don't want to be friend with nobody 
because you've been betrayed before, you've been hurt before, and then now the devil got you cornered, and because he got you cornered, you start being afraid, and then you start doubting, and then you start just feeling that you are unprotected. But God said tonight, I prophesy into your life, your destiny, into your call, into your business. I prophesy into your finances. God who ordained it, God said tonight you're going to start seeing the mighty hand of God. It is called provision. It is called protection. Glory to God. Job was so protected that even the devil testified of Job's protection. But Job doesn't think he's protected. With his own mouth. Tonight all fear is gone. All anxiety I cast out that anxiety anxiety into your life. I destroy that spirit of fear and I remove it from you. Why? Because the blessing of the Lord, he make it rich and doesn't add fear, doesn't add sorrow. I prophesy stability, fearlessness and confidence. You are protected. You are provided for. Come on, say, I receive it. Your finances is provided for. Your finances is protected. Your house is protected. Your children is protected. Your marriage is protected. Come on, say, I receive it. Glory to God. Fear, the Bible says, is a terror. Like you say, terrorist. Fear is a terror. The moment you start fearing of losing your marriage, get ready. How did he get it? It didn't stop, it didn't start overnight. Glory to God. No, it started little by little. God bless you, Dexter. Coffee, God bless you, Mr. Shannon Jones. It didn't start overnight. It started gradually. By the devil telling you, are you sure? This is your marriage, are you sure? Look at the way you guys are arguing. You guys haven't gone out on a date. She has not done that for you. He has not done that for you. That's devil talking. Tell the devil to shut up. <laughs> shut up. My marriage is God ordained. <laughs> you know, you can actually do that. You tell the devil, shut up. My marriage is God ordained and it's God protected. They will tell you, are you sure you guys don't have anything? You know, even as a husband and wife, you should be able to have something. Finances are not there. You tell the devil, shut up. My marriage is God ordained and it's God provided for. Yeah. Just tell the devil, shut up. My marriage is God ordained and my marriage is God provided. My marriage is God protected. He comes into your business and says, have you checked the last two months that you have not made new clients and new sales? Have you checked? Have you noticed? Have you read the news? The economy is changing and uh, your business is kind of going down. You know, you, 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 you probably may gonna wanna, you might want to consider closing down. You might want to consider filing for bankruptcy. Tell the devil, shut up! My business is God ordained and it's God provided and it's God protected. That's how you do it. He comes into your household and starts telling you, look at your children, they're all acting and said, shut up, devil! My household is God ordained and is God protected and is God provided. You got to learn how to respond. Tell him to shut up. The devil talk too much. You must also learn how to talk too much. You keep listening. He keep talking. You tell him to shut up. He runs away like a chicken. The Bible says he is like a roaring lion. Like a roaring. Not, he's not even real. He's pretending to be a lion. When he comes into your business or your ministry or your household, you tell the devil, Katabroke Sutabaya. You tell the devil who the real lion is. The Bible says he is pretending like a roaring lion. When he knock on your door, tell him who the real lion is. Katabaya. God bless you, Apostle Jason Anglin, as a spiritual son all the way from Oklahoma, the senior pastor of Divine Vision International Worship Center. Glory to God, together with his uh, uh, beautiful wife, Dr. Shakira Angling. Glory to God. Yeah. You got to learn how to respond. Job wasn't responding to the attack. He was responding with fear. He said, the things which I fear is greatly upon me. The thing I was afraid of is finally coming. In other words, all this time, Job was afraid. What was his fear? One day, all of this wealth is going to disappear. The moment you start fearing, 
the devil have entered. You keep on fearing, the devil have entered until you stop believing your fear. I tell people, if you keep listening, he keep talking. But God gave a word tonight that will stop the mouth of the devil, stop the voice of the devil. God said, God ordained, God provided for, and God protected. God ordained, God protected, God provided. Let me say it again. What about my business? God ordained, God provided, God protected. What about my marriage? God ordained, God protected, God provided. What about my household? Let me say it again. God ordained, God provided, and God protected. Come and say, my marriage is God ordained and God protected and God provided. Say it one after the other. He said, my marriage is God ordained. My marriage is God, provi God provided. My marriage is God protected. You, you got to learn how to be on the offense, not on the defense. Most Christians are always staying on the defense. It means you're waiting for the devil to attack so you can defend. No, you got to be on the offense. You got to build a shield. You got to, he said, you got you to, gotta, with your voice, confirm the shield. Be like Hannah said, the bones of the mighty are broken. Allah katabaya. For years, she was on the defense and one day she went on the offense. Le katabaya. The Bible said, we are not ignorant of the devices. Kalongre esutabaya. He, she was on the defense. And one day, she went on the offense. Most people in the kingdom, they are on the defense. No, we are not called to be on the defense. You know what that means? You're waiting for the enemy to come. No! You got to be on the offense. And God gave you what tonight. You got to go out. Come out of the cave. Stop waiting for the devil to attack. No, you go out. And you say, I go in your word. God ordained, God provided, and God protected. What about my investment? God ordained, God provided, and God protected. Hey, Katabriki Sundebria. Glory to God. Are you still here? Come on, say, I'm still here. Yes. We're going on the offense. When God gives you what, you collect what God said and you use it. You know what he told Timothy? You find, you find it in 1 Timothy chapter, chapter 1 verse 18. He said, remember the prophecies that went before you that in them thou mightest war a good warfare. He said, use the prophecies. Use it to go to war. Don't use it to wait. Let me read it for you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. I love it. He said, in them that thou mightest war a good war. He wasn't telling him to wait until the enemy attack. No. The war tonight is God ordained. Anytime the devil come, come try to whisper something. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on. This is God ordained. My business is God ordained. My job is God ordained. My house is God ordained. My car is God ordained. My ministry is God ordained. My call is God ordained. My destiny is God ordained. Hold on. It is God ordained. In other words, it's untouchable. Say this, I charge you, son Timothy. I commit unto, I, unto you, son Timothy, according to the prophecies that were spoken over you, that thou mightest by them war a good warfare. Relaka satabaya. Glory to God. God bless you. Man of God, Marvin Bray Jr. It's good to see you. He told him prophecies that were spoken over you. Most people, they do not understand prophecies. Like as I'm prophesying tonight, God said, God ordained, God provided, and God protected. You can use it hey, hey, to go on the offense. I'm stepping out. Glory to God. Let me read it again. The this charge I commit unto thee, son Timothy, according to the prophecies that went before thee, that by these prophecies that thou mightest war a good warfare. Hey, Katabaya. 
He said, you're not going empty-handed. There is a word spoken over you. And I'm speaking that word over your life, over your ministry, over your destiny, over your organization, over your business. I prophesy tonight, you go for you are protected and you are provided for. Why? Because God ordained it. Malaka Satabaya. He said, You might walk good warfare. Mm. Look at look at it. I'm reading it. New King James said, This are charge, this charge I commit to you, some Timothy. Hey, hey. According to the prophecies that was made concerning you. According to the prophecies issued over your life, that by them you may wage a good warfare. In other words, those prophecies are your defense. And tonight, God said, Hey, Kata, Vili Kosuna Maria, thank you, Holy Spirit. Sometimes you're afraid. I don't know how I'm going to make it the next month. No, no, that's Job. It is God ordained. It is God provided and it is God protected. Isn't it interesting that the devil actually testified that the guy was shielded? I've always wondered. You know what the devil has been trying? But when the devil look, the shield is gone. How did the shield got removed? The fear of Job. Job said, Job said the things I was afraid of is finally come upon me. Then he said, Oh, like he said, I was not in safety. Hey, man, if you study this place, it's emotional. What do you mean you were not in safety? I was not in safety. I have no rest. Job was restless because he was waiting for the devil, thinking one day all of these will go away. And when it happened, he was so disturbed in his knowledge that he thought God was the one doing it. Look at what he told his wife. When we have received good from the Lord, should we also not receive evil? Fear can disconnect even your common sense and it would devalue your spiritual knowledge. He told his wife, when we have received good from the Lord, should we also not receive evil? I'm thinking, I'm thinking, are you serious? The blessing of the Lord, he make it to reach and he, the blesser, doesn't add sorrow. When he said make it to reach, dear, in other words, it brings you into a place of structural stability. Your financial stability bring you a place of financial strength. I prophesy into someone tonight. Receive financial strength and financial stability in your life. Glory to God. Most people, they don't have any problem making the money, but it's not stable. Their financing is unstable. But that comes to an end tonight. I prophesy over your finances from today, from tonight. Receive financial strength and financial stability. Come as I receive it. Glory to God. I've seen those who work, they make money. But a little tiny trouble happens and you realize they don't have stability. They work, they get paid. But a little tiny thing, there is no stability in their finances. I prophesy stability in your finances. Strength and stability in your finances. Come and say, I receive it. Glory to God. Come and say, I'll receive it. You know, when it comes to finances, it's not actually about how much you're making. It's about when you have financial stability and financial strength. Some people, they have, they don't have, I've seen those who make 90000 They make 110 And they struggle month to month. I've actually met some of them. They ended up in my office because I'm a financial instructor. Instructor. And financial consultant and counselor. If you're in that place where you don't know what you're doing with your finances, go to the website, glory to God. Go to the website and then consult and then schedule a consultation and we can see how we can help you. Because in the kingdom, we must have stability. <laughs> we must have structure. We must have strength. 
Glory to God. And 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 Aleko Zengri Eliatam. And Jesus said, He that is faithful in the little can be faithful in the much. I tell people that the reason why you're not where you are looking for is because God is waiting for you to, 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 to grow stability where you are. If you cannot have stability in where you are, God is not going to give you anything bigger. Most people are stuck at a certain place. Because God is watching that they can't handle. If I give them something big, I have seen those who say, if God give me money, I'll do that, I'll do that, I'll do that. And I've seen them also money come and they didn't even remember what they said. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Are you still here? Come on, I'm still here. Financial stability. Thank you, glory to God. Hallelujah. Mary, uh, uh, pinch him. Glory to God. It's good to see you. Glory to God, Hunter uh, Chi, Chihuana. Glory to God. It's good to see every one of you that are watching tonight. Glory to God. If you're watching, please don't be quiet. Glory to God. God bless you, uh, Minister Shannon, for releasing your seed. Glory to God. If the Lord is ministering to you, you can release your seed immediately. Glory to God. Hallelujah. This is a prophetic gateway. We have testimony. Somebody just testified that uh, God was speaking about a car. And then the cash was released. From a father that will not normally give money. You have to know that's a miracle. According to the woman, he said the father will not give not one dime. But he brought money for the car. That is the power of the Holy Ghost. Somebody, you are next in line to testify. I prophesy. You are next in line to talk about your testimony. You are next in line. Hey, hey. For a notable miracle. You are next in line. I prophesy. Stability. I prophesy. New testimony. Some people, their testimony is too old. They don't have any new testimony. I prophesy new testimonies into your life. Glory to God. New testimonies. The last time you testified about the notable result notable miracle it has been over six months it has been over one year but god is saying tonight i prophesy brand new miracles brand new testimonies in the name of jesus get ready to testify in your marriage in your finances in your ministry in your destiny glory to god come as i receive it glory to god come as i receive it Thank you, Holy Spirit. That migraine headache is healed. Hey, yeah, when I spoke in tongue, you know, the, the God literally interpreted the tongue into prophecy. That migraine headache is healed. Glory to God. If you're that person, just hold your hands on your forehead and receive your healing right now in the name of Jesus. That migraine headache is Healed. Chantika Smith is good to see you. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Denise Virgo is good to see you. Watching. God bless you, Evangelist Lamisha Blast. Glory to God. God bless you for watching tonight. Glory to God. I'm hearing Graham. I just keep hearing that Graham in my in this very year. The person that goes with Graham. Receive healing. Healing is needed. Receive healing. There are three people here, Alex, Alexa, Alexis. There are three people here goes, I don't know whether people know you by Alexa or Alexis. I'm hearing Alexis. There's an S at the end of it. Alexi, Alexis, Alexis. God is upgrading your spiritual status. God is opening a new door. God is opening access. God is giving you access for resources. God is boosting your spiritual energy and your physical energy. And God is intensifying your, God is intensifying your spiritual eyes. Get ready because you're going to start seeing this. Glory to God. Virilaka Shoheli Adungri Isia. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. I'm hearing Casey. Casey. Somebody goes by Casey. Casey. I'm also hearing Cass. <laughs> Le Ketubri. The person that goes with Casey. Glory to God. You need to forgive your ex-husband. The person that go wow. The person that goes with Cass. Cass might be a short form of something you need to forgive your ex-husband listen to this this <laughs> there is a specific ex-husband there is another ex-husband the person that goes with cars c-a-s-s -S. it could be a short form for a name that's just the way it come in my spirit listen to this 
I can go detail, but I'm not allowed to just go in an extreme details. Verila Katabaye, it is not your only marriage, but it is an earlier husband. Earlier husband and the reason why you need to forgive them because they're standing in your way. They're standing in your way. Kalakutepoya. Dengri is so verula kazengri elikatapaya. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Someone, God is giving your husband a new promotion. A new promotion. You are here as a wife. Receive that promotion right now. Glory to God. Lekatungri is so tapa. Thank God. That attack in your household, sickness attack is removed right now in the name of Jesus. There is a, a, a woman here. Your, your, your daughter have the, the anointing your daughter have a grace a special prophetic anointing here is your, your daughter have a prophetic call and a prophetic anointing also she's going to be a prophetic intercessor she's still young but as young as she is she's already speaking in tongue glory to God Glory to God. Are you still here? Thank you, Holy Spirit. Are you still here? Come on, I'm still here. Glory to God. If the Lord is blessing you, you can release your seed. Glory to God. As some have already released their seed. Glory to God. Don't be quiet. Don't be quiet. Just keep respond, respond, respond. Be sharing. I'm hearing KC. Somebody goes by KC. Another person goes by JC. JC, <laughs> these are short forms. Uh, it comes like that. But the person that goes with KC, KC, that means K and C. Velukakur is in Tebroya. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Hear this clearly. God is changing direction. The purpose haven't changed. God is changing priorities. God is shifting direction. He's shifting priorities the purpose haven't shifted no the purpose is still the same but you have to follow this new new direction new instructions new priorities god is shifting and this will happen immediately read the book don't fear whether people will understand the, the the what you're doing now that's why it's good to have real mentors and real spiritual fathers anytime something like this happens, you got to go to them and then ask Thank you, Holy Spirit. And the person that goes with Jesse, watch out because there is someone that there's a Casey and there's a Jesse. Watch out because there is someone that is planning a betrayal, planning a betrayal and a sabotage. Watch out. God is going to, God is going to uncover them, but stop sharing your vision because you're sharing too much to this person. Discuss your visions to the people above you, the mentors, the, 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 the uh, spiritual midwife, the spiritual mother us and the spiritual father the spiritual mentor those are the ones you share your vision don't share your vision with the one that will kill it glory to god bless you mr jason god is good to see you in the house glory to god hallelujah so the person that goes with jesse make sure that you hear this loudly and clearly glory to god loudly and clearly i'm talking about tonight god say it is god then god provided and god protected if god ordained it he said the blessing of the lord make it rich and added no sorrow in other words, he said the blesser. Now, sometimes, uh, uh, most people, they read that verse and they forgot uh, uh, the rest of it. It actually, it didn't say the blessing of the Lord, make it rich and added no sorrow. No, that's not what he said. That's not what he said. Let me read it the way he said it. Because you've heard this, you know, over the years and you quote, how many of you, you are so sure that when you heard it, it actually sounded like they said the blessing of the Lord, make it rich and added no sorrow. How many of you have heard it quoted like that, even preached on the pulpit? That's why it's good to be able to look at the scriptures. Look at it closely. Look at it closely. God bless you, Minister Tracy Watson. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Tracy Watson, the school of the prophet is coming, so maybe you probably can uh, you know, graduate this year. Felicia Grace, God bless you. Listen to this. Now, they read it like this. The blessing of the Lord make it rich and added no sorrow. That's not what the Bible said. The Bible did not say that. They are excluding one important thing. It actually said the blessing of the Lord, he make it rich. So the blessing will make you rich. 
But then he say, and he, and he adds no sorrow. Who is he? The blesser. Referring to God. The blesser. God bless you, prophetess, uh, 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 prophetess Tammy Cassandra. Tammy Cassandra. Wow. I was saying something about a case, a uh, 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 cast. I don't know whether someone have ever called it with cast. You know, sometimes, you know, to avoid a uh, 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 random god can be specific to exclude something sometimes god can pick up a middle name just to exclude the general public that blessing of the lord he make it rich and he who is he the blesser so tonight god will say god ordain god will say i ordain it i'll provide for it and i'll protect it stop being afraid that prophesy stop Someone you recently published a book and God is going to take you on a book tour. Get ready for a book tour. You are sitting, but God says it's time for you to start scheduling a tour. Start going to places to talk about your book. Glory to God. Veroleke Frika. So God bless you. Minister Priscilla George is going to see you tonight. I prophesy that person that I've written the book. God said, get ready because you're going to be having a book tour. People are out there waiting to buy your book. Glory to God. I see you getting interviewed concerning your book in the name of Jesus. Get ready for multiplication of cells about your book. Glory to God. If the Lord is blessing you, hey, hey, you can sow. You can you can drop your seed. Glory to God immediately. And say, so how can we sow? I usually do it at the end, but there are those that are frequent, frequent at the prophetic gateway, so they know. It's dollar sign, Apostle Sean, glory to God. Dollar sign, Apostle Sean, or, or Zell, Sean.anikajimo.com. Permit me to drink my tea. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Are you still here? The blessing of the Lord, he make it rich, and he, the blesser, does not add sorrow with it. Does not add sorrow with it. Paul said, he which began a good work will complete it. We are still in the we are still in the fourth month, and most people are already treating this year as though it's over. No. Oh, wow. I didn't even know you wrote a book. Wow. You wrote a book and I didn't know. <laughs> I was saying something about I didn't know you wrote a book. I'm serious. Because I don't have a copy. She mailed me a copy. When God bless you, he does not leave you unstable. The Bible says, an unstable man, a, a double-minded man is always unstable in all his ways. You, you don't want to be double-minded. Today you believe, tomorrow you don't believe. Today you believe, tomorrow you don't believe. I'm hearing, I'm hearing Kendra. Zekru iligatengri elitapaya. My goodness, I love when this happens. There are two Kendra here. One is white and one is black. Now, this one is the one, <laughs> I'm putting it as it is. This one is the one that is African American. God say it's time to step out. It's time to launch out into the It's time to launch out. God will say you have not been able to get it because you're not launching out. You can't catch it yet. You can't receive it yet because you're not launching out. You're not launching out. God said it's time to launch out. As you launch out, I do not know what is it God is referring to, but that's the way I hear it. Launch out so that you will see a catch. You will see a result. Peter said, nevertheless, at your word, I will lay down the net. God said, lay down the net because you're getting ready to catch. Launch out. It's time for you to launch out. Then the other case that is a Caucasian still living in America. These two uh, Kendra, this, uh, sorry, Kendra, they all live in the United States. The other one that is a Caucasian, hear this clearly. Hear this clearly. Do not be discouraged because God is taking you off the queue line. I'm putting you in the forefront. You've been waiting for something and waiting for something. And God is removing you, pulling you from here and dropping you right on the arrival, right on the place that you're supposed to be. Your time.
tired of waiting and God didn't tell me what is it that you're waiting for, but God is pulling you from where you are and placing you in the face front, says the Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Are you still here? If it is God ordained, your business, if God ordained it, God will protect for it. God will protect it. God will provide for it. Bad economy is not going to take your business. Inflation is not going to take your business. No. The wars is not going to take you. I prophesy security over your business. Security over your investment. Security over your entrepreneurship. Because I receive security in my business. I receive security in my investment. I receive security. God say, I give you security. If it is God ordained, Kalalungri is suitable. It will be God protected. It will be God provided for. I prophesy security into your business into your investment. I prophesy security. You know, most people, they feel unsafe. They feel unsafe. They think things will go wrong. In my business, things will go wrong. In my investment, things will go wrong. In my finances, I speak security. In your finances, I speak security. In your investment, I speak security. Come on, say, I receive security in my business. God ordained. God provided and God protected. Hey, Carl, every issue. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Fear no more. Fear, all fear is gone. All fear is gone. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yes, security in your investment. Security in your investment. I was contacted by a young man. I call him young man not because he's a young man like in his early 30s. No, young man because I'm older than him. So if I'm older than you, you're a young man. At least contacted me, you know, on TikTok. <laughs> man, now I'm thinking, okay, I'm going to grow followers on TikTok and they're going to storm that place with messages. But I love one thing though, that it lets you see the message before you can choose if you will accept the message to be on your inbox. It lets you see the message before you can choose. Because I went there to drop a person and say, young man, pray for uh, success in my stock market. Uh -huh. And I replied that I see fear, but fear not. God said, I got you. I spoke over his business in my stock market. And right now, my my uh, my uh, my TikTok is you know I didn't pay attention to TikTok until I realized I couldn't add it to my TV network until I reached a thousand. Are you following me? How many of you are following me on TikTok? If you're my TikTok follower, just say I'm I'm I'm, I, I, I'm following you. Go ahead and type it. If you don't have TikTok for the purpose of following me, go and sign up. It's free. Before one day they start charging for it. Lekatabaya. He said, pray for me to be blessed and to be successful in my stock market. And I read that. Hey, you have to know I don't read, you know, Messages on the inbox. I didn't even know that TikTok have inbox. Of course, it should. Because I've not opened it. The first time I opened the inbox was today. So go to go to go to TikTok and follow me. I'm targeting a thousand. We are right now about six hundred and something. I think about should be six ninety. Six hundred and ninety to reach a thousand. The moment I reach a thousand, as you're watching me on YouTube, watching me on Instagram, watching me on Twitter X. You will also be watching me on TikTok. How many of you will love that? I didn't pay attention. I registered on TikTok 2022. I didn't pay attention to it. Because I didn't think I needed it. I never would. When I'm ready, I will add it to my channel. And one day, I tried to add it to the channel. I realized I couldn't. I investigated it. Realized if you don't have up to a thousand followers, uh, 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 they don't see you as a creator. And I'm thinking, what are you talking about? I have thousands of followers everywhere. 
just not on TikTok. So I've been sharing some things on TikTok. I don't know how many of you that are catching it. I didn't know I couldn't go live. I'm not talking about going like and it wouldn't even let me go live on analog. Like put the camera, touch live. Until I invest, why not? I'm there. No, you can't. Until you reach a thousand followers. But we are pushing it. We are pushing it. I'm sure but in fact, possibly by June. That's my target. And once we reach there, then we'll now be broadcasting on 19 channels. We are targeting 20 channels. Very soon when we go live, we'll go live everywhere. As long as you're on this earth and you're on any social app, very soon we'll go live on LinkedIn. Watch out. Now I was investigating to go live on Amazon Live. Hey, Nessa, what are you talking about? You see, listen, the earth is the Lord and the fullness thereof. You got to be able to know that this earth belongs to us. It's not given to the world. You can allow the world to run the earth or you can take part into the government of the kingdom and rule over the earth. Even Telegram. I don't know how many of you that have Telegram app. Very soon we'll be on Telegram too. Yeah. That means it doesn't matter where you are, which app you're using, we will pop up somehow. So if you're on Telegram, very soon when I group, when I create a, a group, join that group because that's where it'll be broadcasting. Yeah, we'll be live on Telegram. We'll be live on LinkedIn. <laughs> when I realized I was investigating Amazon Live, I laughed because to have Amazon Live, I have to have followers on Amazon. But that's not everybody. But so we can push on that one. God bless you, Pastor Ronnie. Glory to God. I was expecting to see you during the Impact Conference and I didn't see you. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Yes. If it is God ordained, that's all that matters. If it is not God, then you will have troubles. Because God won't be able to defend you. But if it is God, then sometimes you will miss it by a little. But because it's God, then God will give instruction of correction. Thank you, Holy Spirit. This is a prophetic instruction. There is a young lady here. You're dating someone outside the country but there is a deception ask that person outside the country whether he's married ask him boldly if he lies leave him he's married everything you're hearing is a lie you're dating someone outside the country and the plan is for you to you know, invite the person, whatever. I can't go in details. But ask the person after this. I don't know which country. God didn't give me a country. God don't even tell me. But you live here in the United States. Ask the person. The person is married. You just haven't asked. In other words, you got to cut it now. Now, here's the thing. You don't know it. So you're not at fault, but you should have kind of like asked a little bit more. You're losing time. And this has been God tangled as songre elita prayer. This is how you're going to know it is you. It started exactly from October 2023. Thank you, Holy Spirit. I'm going into details, but God is not allowing me to go in an extreme. From 2023 October, that's when it started. So this is still fresh. You haven't lost a year yet. So cut it out. So you can save time. God bless you, Dr. Dwayne Murphy. It's good to see you. Apostle Dr. Dwayne Murphy. It's good to see you all the way from Houston, Texas. Glory to God. Glory to God. Somebody goes by Joseph. There is a Joseph here. Joseph, get ready for a new open door. There is a open door and favor that God has planned. Glory to God. Receive it right now. Glory to God. And so if it is God ordained, that's what God is saying tonight. It will be God protected. If God ordained it, he will provide for it. He will protect it. Hmm. Vekula izongri elita paralaba kasun. There is a woman of God here. You are a woman of God. You are also married to a man of God. But hele, hear me clearly. 
they call it but god said you are not respecting your husband enough And that's why the problem is the enemy is using that to attack your marriage. You are not respecting your husband enough. Whatever it is, you have to change because somehow the devil has crept into your marriage. There's a handwriting on the wall. You're not respecting your husband, your female, your wife. You're not respecting your husband enough. I don't know which channel you're watching from, but take correction. Take this instruction right now to save your marriage because the devil is already playing some cut cut a mouse game glory to god god said your business is protected your ministry is protected your destiny is protected there is a woman here your teenage daughter is anointed hey listen to this she's gonna need training she's more anointed than you except she's too young she needs to be trained guide her because right now out of her circle there is one friend that shouldn't be in her circle. You are a mother of a teenager. Le kuro e You are a mother. Your, 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 your daughter is not yet 20 years old. But there is a heavy anointing on her. So you have to be like a lioness to protect your daughter so that can, she can fulfill her destiny. So God is saying that she is called and anointed, but she needs to be trained primarily by you. You got to pay close attention. You're not asking the right question. Because right now there's someone among her circle that is already luring her into smoking weed ask your daughter she will be surprised if she doubt it tell her that she has already smoked uh, uh smoke weed three times already she never brought it home mind you but it's one of her friends she has smoking three times he has not arrived home but if you don't intervene that will become something she will do every day. She knows it's wrong, so she has not brought nothing home. Investigate it and make sure that person in her circle is removed, says the Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Holy now, you see, a prophetic gateway is an atmosphere for prophetic instructions. Sometimes it comes as a prophetic instructions. Glory to God. It comes as instructions and as a directive prophecies. And that is what happened. God is giving instructions. He's giving instructions. Glory to God. There is somebody here, you're, 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 you're due for another car. But listen, the car is down, don't trade it. Don't trade the car. Believe God. When God gives you another car, sow this one away. Sow it. Because if you trade it, you will lose value. Listen, God is going to have this car. But when you get a new one, don't trade this one. Let me dare you. If you dare to trade it, you wouldn't get up to 2000 The car is fine. They will devalue it because you are trading it. God said there is a family that need that car. Sow that car away. Once it's fixed, then go get another one. You have good credit. That's how you're going to know. Is you have good credit. Don't trade it because your 2000 is nothing. They will devalue it. You can't get up to 2000 God says sow the car. There is a family that need that car. Sow that car away because God is blessing you with another one. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. It's a prophetic gateway. It's a prophetic vault. It's a, it's a mystery. That's what's happening right now. I'm trying to give instructions. God is giving instructions, prophetic instructions. Glory to God. Someone you're scheduled for. Hey, Hold your hands here on the neck. There is a neck surgery. Something that's a growth here. Right now, there's a growth. God is removing that growth. Glory to God. You're going to wake up and you're going to realize that the growth is gone. Glory to God that the growth is gone. Says the Holy Spirit. Pastor Ronnie, God said, finish the book you're writing. Hey, <laughs> hey, Finish the book. That's exactly the way God said it. Finish the book you're writing. Finish the book. When you finish it, you will see. Finish the book. God bless you. Share that mark. Watching from my wife. Okay, good. You got it? Yeah. That's exactly, God didn't even say, like, trying to go in detail. He was just like, finish the book. Tell 
Pastor Ronnie finished the book. And when God said that, it means you have to go into action. Glory to God. God bless you, Dr. Dwayne Murphy, for releasing your seed. If the Lord is blessing you, you can release your seed immediately. God ordained. Yeah. Hey, when God ordained it, when God ordained it, it'll be God provided. It'll be God protected. God bless you, Apostle Dr. Dwayne Murphy, for releasing your seed. If the Lord is blessing you, you can release your seed immediately. Glory to God. That's what's happening. It's a prophetic vote. God said, stop being afraid. Stop worrying whether it'll be that, whether that will happen, whether that will happen. God said, I ordain it. I will provide for it. And I will protect it. The blessing of the Lord, they make it rich and added no sorrow. Every fear, I remove that fear from you. I remove that anxiety from you. I remove that anxiety and somebody here you recently have a panic attack two weeks ago all of a sudden you felt like you everything just the world is crashing on your panic attack that is a demonic attack i remove that attack from you and i put fresh fire to flush up like a whirlwind that attack will never repeat itself receive boldness glory to god receive confidence God said, fear not, I am with you. With a servant, I go in glory to God because I ordain it, I provide for it, and I protect it, says the Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Come and say, I receive it. Glory to God. My goodness, time is flying like a, like a, like a speed of light. Glory to God. Glory to God. Are you still here? Come on, say, I'm still here. Hey, hey. What's happening? We are in a prophetic gateway. It's an atmosphere of a prophetic vault, a portal of mysteries. Hey. God is giving someone, I see a, a SUV, a black SUV, a black SUV Lexus. I don't know who is eyeing Lexus. Somebody's been wanting to get SUV, a black SUV. Lexus, Haleke to Kadabaya, receive your Lexus. Hey, Vengro Eligatangra Aliteke Rodabaya. Someone else is interested. I see Tesla. I see a very nice looking Tesla. Is it really possible? God is mentioning that means God is uh, providing for receive your SUV, Lexus SUV, and receive your Tesla. There's a specific person here. You want an SUV. I'm looking at this black SUV. Very clean. Come as I receive it. Hey, and there's someone here. You recently was not approved for a car. But God said, I approve you tonight. Hey, Langre is shooter. Come as I receive my approval for a car. When God approves you for a car, no car company will turn you down. God say you are approved for a car. God bless you, Miliana Vivita. It's good to see you. Glory to God. Leta bakata gen de kiri isu tabaya. Venkuru ali de kingru aso farile gezunda. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Glory to God. My goodness, time is flying, 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 flying. Come as I receive it. My business ha, is God ordained. E la katabaya. Yes. Somebody, you need to be approved. Come as I receive my approval. Maybe you might be I Mercedes or even BMW. But when God approves you, it means no car company will decline it. Somebody, you were told you were not approved. My goodness. And there's another person, you told you go get a co-signer. But tonight, God is approving you. It will be like a miracle. A young lady earlier this year, back in February, you know, she, she just went in. You know, and then walked out with a very clean Mercedes. It was, and if you, if she tell you the story of her approval, you will not believe it. Because when you do what God tells you to do, hey, hey, God get glory when it happens. Glory to God. Somebody, you have been approved for a car. Come on, I receive my approval for a car. You don't need a co-signer. God said, I have approved you. Glory to God. Come on, I receive my approval. God ordained, God provided, and God protected. Come and say, I receive it. Hey, hey, my business is God ordained. Come and say, my marriage is God ordained. Maliki Sotabaya. 
My investment is God ordained. Did I tell you that God is giving you security? <laughs> I told you about your business and your investment. But right now, receive security in your marriage. I prophesy security in your marriage. I prophesy security. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Stable and security into your marriage, in your household. Come on, I receive it. Security in your marriage. Security in your household. Security over you and your children. Somebody you a single mother. God is bringing security between you and your children. Glory to God. You and your household. Your marriage receive that security. Your marriage is God ordained. Your household is God ordained. You and your children is God ordained. And God said receive security. I prophesy security. Come on, I receive security in my marriage. I receive security for me and my children. If you're a single mother, I receive security in my household. Glory to God. In my household. If somebody here, your husband is drinking. God is removing the appetite of that drunkenness. That drunkenness. Your husband drinks. And as I'm telling you, you know it. Your wife, your husband is not watching. You're watching as a wife. Your husband drink alcohol. And he, he gets drunk sometimes. And not only that, he does more than alcohol. He does other things that makes him under the influence. And you have been believing God for that to stop. But God said tonight is the end of his drunkenness. Tonight is the end of it. But drinking and doing drug, he has not gotten in trouble, but he's this close in getting in trouble. God said, I've heard your cry. That appetite of alcohol and whatever else is taken tonight, God is removing it. Glory to God. God is removing it. Come as I receive security in my destiny. Sometimes you don't think your destiny is protected. You don't think, you know, you've been betrayed so many times that you don't even think it's what going out there for. You don't even want to step out because you trusted, get betrayed, trusted, get betrayed, trusted, get betrayed, get betrayed, get betrayed, and then get sabotaged, get sabotaged, get sabotaged, and then get looked down upon, get looked down upon because you have not arrived. But God has said, I ordain it, I'll provide for it, and I will protect it. I prophesy over your destiny. Receive sick security in your destiny. Receive security in your call. Receive security in your ministry. Come as I receive security in my ministry. Come as I receive security in my destiny. Come as I receive security in my call. Come as I receive it. God ordained, God provided, and God protected. Stop fearing. If God ordained it, hey, hey, he will protect it. If God ordained it, he will provide for it. Glory to God. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. It's happening tonight. It's happening tonight. Yes. Somebody goes to your last name, James. Last name, James. I see you signing a contract. God, God, God said, go ahead and sign it. Father, approved it. You're signing the contract. Go ahead and sign it. Hey, hey I love when God gives that, that, that go, that green light. God said, I'm giving you green light. Go and sign it. I see you sign the documents. You go by James. Veklo asutabaya. Come as I receive it. Glory to God. Verilegingre isum faradabaya. Come as I receive it. I receive it. I receive it. I receive it. Glory to God. I receive it. Glory to God. My goodness. We already reached 28 minutes into an hour and a half. Glory to God. Time is flying. Glory to God. But listen, today is Monday. Hey, hey. I'll be back on Friday. God allowing it, God permitting it, depending. Let me see. Yeah, well, you will know if I'm going to be live on Friday, you will also know that I'm going to be live. Glory to God. Hallelujah. But listen, I want you to pick up a seed tonight. Yes, great confirmations. Great confirmations. Yes. God is a prophetic vault. Michael, glory to God from USA. I want you to pick up a seed. There are those that have already released their seed. <laughs> this is a, you can title the seed God ordained. God ordains. God's security. That means God is securing it or God provided. You can title the seed God ordained or you can call it God protected or you can call it God provided. God provided. God said, if I ordain it, I will protect it. I will provide for it. 
the blessing of the Lord, he make it rich, and he, the blesser, does not add sorrow. He does not add sorrow. You want to join them with the seed? Let me know that you're joining them because I'm about to pray over the seed. Glory to God. Listen, when the Lord <laughs> do something like this, you got to be able to know how to respond. Some of you, my, somebody, you are needing an open door. You, you, there's something you believe in God for. You, you, when you sow this seed, you title that seed open door. Somebody, you're believing God for a special wide open door. You are in a place where that door has to open now because you are this close in missing the window. No, certain in life is missing a window. And then having the opportunity pass you by. If you're that person, you can drop a seed and title that seed open door. Then when I pray between midnight and 3 a.m., I know exactly how to handle it. Glory to God. You need open door. You're in a place where you really need that door to open up. You need an open door. You need an open door. Thank you, Holy Spirit. If you're joining them with a seed, join them. Glory to God. Somebody goes, well, I'm still hearing that James. James, God said, go ahead and sign. Go ahead and sign. Sign the contract. I see you initialing your name and signing your name and then say initially. You go by James. And this James is not a first name. It's a, it's a wow. It appears as a middle name. Maybe middle name, maybe you go with the three names. Thank you, Holy Spirit. So I want you to pick up a seat. Glory to God. It's already 10 27. We're gonna get out of here in uh, in a few minutes. Glory to God. Are you still here? Come and say I'm still here. Pick up a seat. Pick up a seed, and if you're joining them, let me know that you're joining them. Glory to God. A seed, how much are you sowing? No, God didn't give me an amount. If God gave me an amount, then I'll flow with it. Glory to God. So you pick up an amount that God have already instructed you uh, to give. How do you sow dollar sign? Apostle Sean for Zell. Sorry, for Cash App. And there's Zell is Sean.AnikaDreamer.com. That is also good for PayPal. Or you can go directly to my website, which is www.SeanAnikaDreamer.com. Dot com. I'm getting ready to pray over this seed. Are you ready? Glory to God. If you're joining them, join them. Maybe you are using your devices and you can sow after uh, the broadcast. Glory to God. If you are among them that want to include, uh, want to sow after the broadcast, you can identify yourself. Glory to God. Thank you. Some of you have been approved for car. So when you sow that seed, you can write approved for car. Approve for car. Thank you, Holy Spirit. There is a Damien and there is also a Daniel. Two different people. I'm hearing the name Damien. Damien, your car is in the shop. Uh, they've repaired it. You don't have money to get it out. But between now and the next 48 hours, your car is coming out of the shop. And then there is a Daniel. Your healing is complete. Whatever it is that happened is not coming back. Daniel is your name. God say your healing is complete. Whatsoever that happened that disturbed your health is not coming back. Your healing is complete, says the Holy Spirit. Glory to God. Glory to God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. God bless you, Jemiah Alexander. For releasing your seed. I'm going to pray over the seed right now. If you're joining them, there's an hour to join them or the moment to join them or you can join them over or after the broadcast. Father, in the name of Jesus, I speak over all the prophetic seed that is connected here tonight. Father, your word tonight it says you ordain it, you will provide for it and you will protect it. I open the floodgate of heaven and I move the well window of your blessings over your people for provision for protection because you have ordained it. Some are needing open door. The person that is sowing for open door right after tonight, begin to open the door that they are praying for. Glory to God. Those that need security in their marriage, security in their finance, security in their business, security in their destiny, in their call, security in their ministry, I speak and release it right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Glory to God. Come inside, receive it. Come inside, receive it. Glory to God. 
Come as I receive it. If you're joining them with a seed, you can join them with a seed. Hallelujah. Dollar sign apostle Sean. Glory to God. Or Sean.anikajima.com for Zell. And if you have my phone number, you can so directly through the phone number. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Are you still here? Hallelujah. We are approaching, uh, closing the broadcast. And before that, we thanks to defend all the kingdom businesses. If you wanted to subscribe to our TV network to promote your book, maybe you have written a book, kingdom book, or any kind of book, we can promote your book on our network. Glory to God. Or maybe you have a business. You know, we represent a lot of companies. You can pro we can promote your business on our network. We attract 15 to 20,000 viewers on a weekly basis, which puts us, which puts the views a total of 85 to 100,000 in a month. So we can push your business. Glory to God. Push your business on the radar of our network. Glory to God. And with that said, we will be right back after this commercial break. We'll be right back. Today, people and business owners have a ton of options to choose from when it comes to web developers, graphic designers, social media marketing, branding, and the list goes on. And that might not be such a good thing. What if there was one company that you and your business could trust that could provide all these services at prices that won't eat up your business capital before it gets off the ground? From logo design, branding, custom website development, hosting, social media marketing, print media design, and more. Infusion does it all under one roof with a team of professionals that are just a phone call away. Infusion Design Solutions, the infusion of exceptional design and affordability. Visit us online at infusion.com. I need an all-in-one web design, print, and media company. Hmm. Web, design, print, media. Infusion Design Solutions. Visit us online at infusion.com. we are back that is some businesses that uh, we are currently promoting and uh, some about three accounts came to a close uh, March 31st so we're taking new client how does it work uh, you have a business you have a book that you're written and uh, you can come to us glory to God when you come to us we will tell you what we require we can help create the content for you that means the advertisement video clips or you can bring your own content and we have subscriptions for packages of one month we have a package for two months we have a package for three months and we also have a package for six months and also one year what that means is that when we go live on a prophetic gateway which attract 18 channels and we are still increasing our channel we actually have you know right now 18 channels and we're moving to 20 channels very soon glory to god we attract 15 to uh, 20 000 viewers on a weekly basis right now we are broadcasting real time on 18 different channels we're live on facebook we're live on about several Facebook pages, 
We're live on YouTube. We're live on Instagram. We're live on Twitter X. And very soon we'll be live on uh, uh, Telegram. We're live. Uh, we're going to be live on LinkedIn. And we're also going to be live on TikTok. Are you following me on TikTok? Go and follow me. So the packages run from one month, two months, three months, six months, and one year. You can bring your own content. And then we'll give you the, the, the requirement. Or if you don't have a content, we'll sit with you, have a consultation with you, and then we create the content for you, for your book or for your business, for your company, for your entrepreneur, for your investment, for your minister, for your upcoming event. Could be wedding event, could be birthday event, could be anniversary event. We promote all of it. It could be a book launch. We recently promoted a book launch uh, for a month before the book launch was and if you go to the book launch, it was successful. Glory to God. So contact us on the website, which is www.seananike.com or you can call the number on the screen. That is 866-7-DR-SEAN. That is 866-737-7327. To six glory to God, and with that said, my name is Apostle Sean, your beloved prophet, your beloved mentor, your beloved spiritual father, your beloved kingdom pusher, your beloved business trainer, business advisor, financial advisor. This is Dr. Sean signing out. God bless you, and good night.